Welcome to the Vulture's Nest. Billionaire investors swoop down on your business proposals and peck out the eye. Um... Forget it. I'm out. Uh, uh, Vultures. Almost every kid wears a retainer, and that is not cool. But this retainer is a D-lame. And realize I needed to drill in Texas instead of my home state in New Hampshire. Well, I'm very interested. I'll offer you three hours of my precious time for 90% of your company. We've heard enough. Thank you for the opportunity. Do you want a beer, son? Huh? There's a stain. Did that dumb dog pee on the rug? Oh, it wasn't a dog. I went on the rug. Grandpa, don't worry. We're paying the finest nursing home in town. Don't know what to do. We had no idea what to do. I've been paying you off and on for years, and there's no way you can help? We do offer free transportation to the next stage. <laughs> yeah, that's shameful, shoving poor old people out on the street. This place is for the mentally ill. <laughs> hey, what are you... Uh, get better. The VA hospital will help. Aren't those hospitals the ones they called America's Shame? A lot of things are America's Shame, honey. Mr. Simpson? Yes? Uh, th this is just the waiting room. Oh. Hey, soldier. Are you looking for high-quality health care at no cost? I know the place. Tell it to me in an anecdote. Years ago, I saw action in the Bay of Pigs. <laughs> <laughs> mm, history. Those Cuban doctors patched me up good, and for a lot less. Cuba sounds a little dangerous. Why don't we try Canada? I don't want to go there, now that that commie Trudeau is in charge. We're going to Cuba. <laughs> oh! Grandpa, can't you enjoy the Caribbean breeze? And we'll have fun when we get there. We can have plantains. They're like bananas you have to cook. Yum. Cooked bananas are too hard for me to chew. Oh! I am finally going to put the Spanish I learned on I Love Lucy to use. Oh, Lucy, you need to see a psychiatrist. Excuse me, sir. We are perfectly able to pronounce psychiatrist. Now, there are 12 types of visits to Cuba that are legally permitted. U.S. business. Next. And the last one is journalistic activity. I'm a journalist. I'm doing an article for my school paper. Here's one of my scoops. Hmm. You're in. I don't like dominoes. With my cataracts, everything's a six. Uh, what? Let me just take one last good look at my granddaughter so she'll remember her granddad. I am so sorry. There is uh, nothing I can do. All I can offer is this uh, festive shirt. I don't like the way the birds are looking at me. Oh my god! Where have you been all these years? Now this is a car. Razor sharp fins. Do you care to go for a ride? Car keys that don't go bloopity bloop. I'm home. Oh, my friend just had a Cuba gasm. <laughs> Dad, let me help you out. <laughs> I don't need no help. Is the car. All our American cars were built before 1960, and studies show that exposure to objects from your youth can help you feel young again. Wow, that's the first time I've seen him get a woman's attention without flatlining. Now here's one that's been in our family for years. Okay, so let me get this straight. This Paladar is a restaurant, but it's in a home? That's right. This place is so homey. Look, Grandpa's eating like a horse. So you are enjoying the horse? <gasps> <laughs> no, no. Gracias. ¿Cómo estás tú? Bart, you're using informal Spanish with someone who's not a family member. Like a rumba. <laughs> Look at me, Jasper. I'm eating a peanut. Who's that guy? Hmm, who knows? But I'm sending him a picture of my junk. 
Another El Presidente cocktail, Senor Abraham. I don't remember telling you my name. You did. In fact, you are so charming, I want to hook up later. Why don't you let me buy this round, Abe? Wales McGrath! I knew you in the Air Force! I haven't seen you since you dropped that A-bomb off the forklift! Cuba's great! It's like Florida before all the Cubans came! So what happened to you? <laughs> I... I hijacked a plane here in the set. Yes! Yes! The future of Angola is the future of Cuba! Are you sure we had to take this route? Hey, I like hacking. Are you ready for the surprise of your life? Can you give it to me in stages? <gasps> there she is. It's all ready to open as a nightclub, babe. All we have to do is clean it up and hack a 50-foot wide path to civilization. Okay, I'm in. <laughs> we'll fix that. See? Fixed. Dad, you can't stay in Cuba. For the first time in years, I feel young and healthy, and I found love. Do you want to stay and be with your Cuban chica? She makes me weak in the knees. You're always weak in the knees. Que seguir de modo cruel Contra el pueblo conspirando Para seguir explotando Y en eso llegó Fidel I don't know where my dad is. Don't worry. Each AARP card contains a secret tracking chip. Bam! Got him! Andre here sold secrets to the Soviets, and this is the guy who came up with the service fee for Ticketmaster. Yeah! Dude, what are you doing here? Who are these people? This guy was the biggest drug lord in North American history, and this guy invented Ticketmaster. <laughs> you charge me to sell me something! Pleased to meet you, sir. Miami, this is Jitterbug Justice bringing back an early bird special. Miami, do you copy? Uh, we copy. I'm starting to suspect you're not a simple Cuban bartender. No, I'm an undercover agent for the CIA here to recapture fugitives from U.S. law. Oh, thank God. Usually I can never sleep on planes. Sometimes I... I uh... Oh, that's the end of my Cuban paradise. And like every good thing in my life, I've already forgotten. <laughs> <laughs> no, now we're two men hogging. Want to hit the links? Oh, just like we used to. <laughs> <laughs> I just painted a black circle on the green. Why, you little! <laughs> <laughs> we all know TV dinners, but what about toilet breakfasts? Here's my offer. No money, and I get 100% of the company. Don't know about you. Girl, I'm still